Hello, I'm Dr. Duff Sprawls of the Space Coast Cancer Center, and I'm here to talk to you about the side effects of radiation therapy. As radiotherapy inevitably damages some healthy cells, most patients will experience some side effects. The severity and duration of the side effects will depend upon what part of the body was targeted by radiation, the radiation dose, the duration of radiation therapy, and the speed of recovery of the cells. On some occasions, side effects may be felt during a radiotherapy procedure, while others may not emerge for weeks or even months later. Below are some of the usual side effects most commonly reported by patients. By far and away, fatigue is the most common side effect of radiotherapy. Often felt before the whole radiation therapy course ends, it's usually the worst two weeks after following radiation completion. Experts say that light exercise can sometimes help relieve symptoms as well as accelerating the recovery from radiation. Diarrhea. If the beams are aimed at the abdomen, diarrhea can occur. Patients commonly report symptoms within a few days of the commencement of treatment. As the radiotherapy course progresses, symptoms may get worse. You need to tell this to your treatment team so that this can be managed with medications. There's also a possibility of heart disease. This risk is especially occurs when the heart is in the line of fire of the radiation beam. This might be the case in some breast and lung or esophageal cancer treatments. When the breast tumor is on the left side of the chest, the heart is within the beam of the radiation. Nausea may occur at any time during the treatment course. It is important to tell your doctor because this is easily treated with medications. Muscle and joint stiffness. This may also be accompanied by swelling in the area that's receiving the radiation treatment. If symptoms are severe, the doctor may have to send you to a physical therapist to recover. There's also the possibility of skin damage. Areas that are exposed to radiation can be burned like a sunburn. Patients should protect that area of skin from sunlight as well as from perfumed soaps and chemicals. Scratching and rubbing will also irritate the skin more and make it worse. Medications may be ne needed to provide relief from radiation burns, such as lotions and creams. Lowered libido, or sex drive, is a common side effect for both male and female patients. Their ability to participate in sex may also be affected. A woman's vagina may become narrower if the beams are aimed in that area, and a vaginal dilator will help prevent this narrowing. Experts say that regular sex after treatment may help prevent vaginal narrowing also. Vaginal dryness is also a possible side effect. For men, if the beams are aimed at the pelvis or genital area, as may be the case with prostate cancer treatment, nerve bundles involving erectile function may be affected, and the man may have problems with either getting or maintaining an erection.